Well, hello there, everybody. Dre here. And you know what I love to do after a hard day's work? Experience the sweet embrace of a shovel in a game called Snow Plowing Simulator. Yes, there's a simulation game for everything these days. And, uh, well, shoveling snow is something I didn't expect people would find fun. But if the physics are there, and indeed they seem to be, uh, it could be super satisfying. So, yes, uh, this is a game where we are running a snow plow business. And you know what? I mean, it's not pretty in here, but I've seen, I've played a lot of simulation games and it's been way worse than this. We just need to clean the place a little bit. Oddly enough, this one, I don't think we can clean. Right now, I think we're supposed to buy a shovel. I, I guess that's the point. I mean, we are going to need, need a shovel. And would you look at that? A small spade for $50. All right. Well, one day we might be able to use our truck, but unfortunately I already checked and uh, we have lost our keys. So, I guess we gotta start with the shovel. Did I grab the shovel? I don't know what I'm doing in this game. Oh, it's in delivery. Okay, it is a simulation game. We have to wait for it to be delivered. Oh, I just heard a beep. Hello? Do you have my shovel? What? Who the hell beeped? Oh! <laughs> wait, wait. Is this, is this a cardboard package in the form of a shovel? That is beautiful. All right, and here we are. This is, this is what we're gonna be doing for the next, you know, 10 to 15 minutes. We're just gonna shovel snow. I have to say, this is actually accurate to real life. Being Canadian, I do do a lot of this. My question is, where is the snow going after I throw it out of the shovel? I don't want to know, because I don't want to have to deal with that snow. Oh my god, this is going to take forever. Is this what you want me to do? Oh, I need to hold Q to see what needs to be cleared. Okay, so we're just clearing the footpath. Thank god. I thought it was going to make me do this whole parking lot. Can I just clear it with stomping around? Oh, I just realized I'm very cold and I also burn calories. So maybe running in the snow, not the best idea. What the hell is this? Oh, it's the weather station. This is, how do I get rid of it? Oh, X, that would make sense. Um, It's already nighttime. That's a bad thing, right? I was probably supposed to do that a lot quicker. Uh, I, I know it said I need, I need tea to warm up. Oh, great. I just realized I'm only wearing a thin sweater so you can actually see where this game's going. I should mention we are playing the demo, obviously. I want to get LO3. That looks badass. All right. So now we are in the food area. I can get chocolate cake for whatever reason. I think I'm going to buy a tomato soup. Uh, yes, I will buy one for $4 and I'll also buy a cookie just because I want one. Oh my god, you can buy cough syrup. So it seems like weather is going to be a big aspect of this game and dealing with, this, with the... Um, sicknesses that can ensue uh i guess i'm just gonna continue to shovel and i will shovel now as we wait for my tomato soup to get here what the hell is that 500 dollars great give me it is this is this where this game's gonna be fun i can find 500 dollars bills just hanging around i don't know how to grab it oh my god it's daytime already man i am not that efficient am i <laughs> i spent all night doing this and i just want to grab my 500 dollars. maybe i gotta get rid of the plow and yeah, someone lost some money. It's mine now. Who the hell just has $500 on them? That's insane. All right, so maybe in a week or so, we might be able to get this pathway done. But uh, I have to say, the more I play this, the more I understand. You know, it's very power wash simulator-like. Super satisfying. And it's not bad when it's not real life because you don't actually have to do the work, you know? I am starting to freeze, though. Like, literally, my eyes are freezing shut. I should probably worry about that. I do want to get this done, though. Okay, I'm coughing now. I don't want to have to buy cough syrup. Let's get inside. There was supposed to be tea. So oh, my God. I'm freaking out. I is that me shivering? Okay. Okay. Maybe we'll... Oh, we have no meds. That's smart. Sweet. Well, all I have left is a cookie. So, I, I'm just going to eat that. Oh, God damn it. I thought for sure there'd be tea somewhere here. Uh, oh. Oh. <laughs> Uh, I'm blind, man. I am blind. I don't have coffee. I have to buy it first. And I have tea. I don't have tea. I have to buy it first. God damn it. I didn't even see tea in here. Items. Okay. Well, it's right there in, in front of me. I'll buy tea because it's cheaper. Okay. And yes, I will like to drink that. Hopefully that warms me up a little bit. Let's have another one. Okay. I'm coughing everywhere. I might have to buy cough syrup as well because this is just going to bother me. All right, $10 for that. Yep, we'll buy that. I'm also going to need to get some food. Chips are very unhealthy, but you know what? It fills the calories, so I do not mind. And I just ate a whole bag of chips. Nice. Breakfast of champions. All right, I got my cough syrup. We have seven doses of that. We'll take one because I'm pretty sure I've gotten a cold. I think I might be okay now. 
Oh no, vision is very blurry. <laughs> What is I'm gonna kill myself just doing a sidewalk. This is a bad sign. Back to work. When it says 40 degrees Celsius, is that my internal temperature? I hope I mean I'm I'm very hot then, right? I, I don't know what I'm supposed to be. I don't know what normal temperature is. Is that bad? Uh should I have more tea? I don't know if this will help or not. I'm I'm actually go I think I'm gonna die, so I might be too hot. I don't know what's going on with me. Maybe that's the sign of a headache. It does feel throbbing. So maybe he wants aspirin. I don't know. Just buy all the drugs. $20. I'm sure I have enough. All right. So yeah, the aspirin worked. That was my issue. Not anything else. I guess I did have a fever. So 36 is like stable. We are back in business. All right. Well, it's night two of the great sidewalk cleaning. But look at this. We're at 94%. I can't. I can't believe it took me two days. Mind you, I almost died on, on day two, so I spent a long time troubleshooting that. This game is no joke, though. Like, I have no room for error. I got to get every little freaking piece. Look at it. Like, this thing is done. Like, look at it. I have to do this kind of sideways. If I touch that wall, I can't shovel it. Oh, my God. 99.7. You are a jerk. There we go. 100%. Oh, I almost died. But I guess I did it. Hello? Do the lights not working here? Weather station, outside light, light in the office. Whoa. Okay, there we go. Okay, so I think, do you want to try and pass the job? Clear snow 100%. What the frick are you talking about? I'm done. How do I, I, I already tried to assign this. It's right on my little pin here. I can't click it. I can't finish this, but it's at 100%. Is it not officially 100%? Like, is there a little piece here that I need to get? Like this thing? Oh, I should probably read what's directly on my screen. You guys know I never read my screen. All right, there we go. <laughs> Oops. All right, so that took seven minutes. That was fun. I felt like that was a lot more than seven minutes. What the hell do you mean by wait? Like how much snow I removed? <laughs> there's even snow type. Oh my God, this game, I'm kind of invested into it now. If there's going to be like heavy snow, slushy snow, uh, that's going to be super interesting. Okay, so now I have to do the big path. But I did see, now that we're a professional shoveler, would you look at this? We can get a small shovel now. Look at this thing. This thing's got wheels on it. Oh, I'm, I'm so intrigued by some of these. So this should help us a lot, though. We'll buy this for $160. I don't know where my money's coming from, but thank God I have some. And that's the ordinary shovel. How do I equip the big boy? Oh, wait. I have to unbox it. Dude, I love these packages. That's right. Okay, hold on. All right, here we go. So, yeah, all of this needs to be done. So, <laughs> Now we can just scoop, and when it fills up, you just let go of it, I guess? Oh, I can just keep going? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Where is it going? I have 31 kgs in here, so I think it just kind of va vanishes when it's on the top. Obviously, this is not how this shovel normally works, but yeah, it just kind of builds up so I can do whole lanes. And it vanishes once it's at the top. There is a bar, as you can see, when I am plowing. Is that the max it can hold? that's like 100 kgs of snow. Oh my god, I got a headlamp? Oh, no, no, that's not a headlamp. I thought it, oh, the light just automatically turned on be, be, because it's dark. But no. I found a key to the private room. Ooh. What goes on in the private room? Let's go find out. Let's take a break because I'm starving to death anyways. All right, what should we eat today? A croissant, some hot dogs, chocolate cake, hamburger... Let's just let's just have a, a nice healthy snack of energy drinks. I'll buy three of those. Cause it's two thousand calories. I don't think energy drinks have that many calories. It's just high in sugar generally. But you know what? It fills my bar and I am good once again. No wonder why this guy has health problems. Alright, well, here is the private room. What the Yeti table? Yeti table! All oh, the plot thickens. Okay. What the hell is this? I thought this was a snow plowing game. Pickup keys. Now you can drive the pickup truck. There will be artifacts found during the game. will be arranged into a story. We're hunting the freaking Yeti. In a snow plowing game. What is this? Ah, uh, there's a bunch of codes here. So yeah, there's a whole mysterious story of the town. Okay, you know what? I kind of love this because I was like, how's a snow plowing game going to be fun after a while? But if there's a deep plot about yetis around here or something, that sounds pretty interesting. So we have the truck now, but we may as well finish up this because, well, we're nearing the end now. And we do need to get more quests. 
I just love how it's been like a week and I still haven't plowed my own driveway. Maybe I shouldn't be running a plowing business if I take this long to do anything. Oh my God, it's not letting me finish. Please, there's no snow here. Come on, these lines really don't matter. Like, look at I'm picking up zero kgs of snow doing all this. There is no room for error. There we go. We just found the 10.5 kg mound. I don't know why that popped up so crazy. Hopefully after this line, come on, just 0 0.4, 99.9. Just let me go experience the world, please. It's been a week of dealing with this. Why is this staying? Go away. Oh, okay. There we go. 100%. Thank God. Congratulations. You can start your adventure now. Start with your neighbors. Oh my God. We have vehicles. It is turning nighttime though. So maybe I should we'll wait for daytime. Why does time go so quick in this damn game? Well, I'm almost starved to death again. So you know what that means? We have to, uh, oh wait, they changed the menu. <laughs> what does the menu change? Where's my energy drinks? I saw the hamburger before, but ooh, 2,400 calories with black chocolate. Well, you know what we're eating today, ladies and gentlemen. It just makes sense. How is this more than a freaking burger? Almost double that of a burger. You know what? I'm just going to buy some more of these to have them in my pocket because anything that's high in calories is what I need. And there we go. Three chocolate bars. We are good once again. One more thing I will buy now that we're actually going to be exploring is in the items here, I believe it was. We have uh, terms. <laughs> You mean thermos? <laughs> How did you get that to terms? <laughs> All right, so we'll buy terms and uh, that will allow us to take hot liquid with us because we do get cold rapidly in this damn game. In delivery. Oh my God, I got to wait for freaking delivery on my terms. Ah, oh, my terms. Oh, now it says thermos. I wonder why it says terms and the other thing. All right, so how does this work? Do I just fill it? Uh, I don't want to... I'll, I'll, I'll have a drink of tea, but how do I... No cough? I, didn't, I can't have tea? Are you freaking serious? Now I have to go buy coffee? Goddamn terms and their stupid rules. All right, so we'll buy coffee. That's auto-delivered for some reason, by the way. And now I just want it in my damn thermos. Oh, yeah, there we go. Terms one liter. Yes. All right, it is time to rock and roll. We're going to open the gate. Get inside this bad boy. Look at this. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I didn't even realize it was on. Is this electric? Aww. <laughs> God damn it, are you serious? Oh, I'm so invested in this now. I just wanted to do one run with the vehicle. That's too bad. I have to say from what I've seen though, it seems remarkably in depth. And when it comes to the physics of the snow, uh, it definitely seems very, very satisfying. So yeah, unfortunately this was a pretty short demo, but I do want to send this to you guys to see what you guys think about it. Cause I definitely do want to be checking it out when it does come out. Uh, seems like a rather good simulation game. So I hope you guys enjoyed some snow plowing today. Took us a week to get out of our garage. And yeah, in the next episode, if you do want to see some more, once it does come out, uh, we'll leave off where we left off in hopefully the vehicle. As always, guys, thanks for watching and liking. And I'll see you in the next one.